Hey friends, today in this video we are going to make a version 2 of RFID tag attendance system in which if the RFID tag is scanned then the name of the card holder, time and date will be get updated in Google spreadsheet. And thank you everyone for giving me the best uh, support in RFID tag attendance version 1. I hope uh, you will give the uh, support in this RFID version 2 uh, also. I hope you finish uh, 250 likes for this video and uh, share this video among with your friends and do subscribe for more such videos. So let's get started with this video. So friends to make this project the requirements that we need are a node MCU, RFID reader module and tags, jumper cables, a 5 volt budget follow this circuit diagram and make your connections after successful connections connect your node mcu to pc so first of all uh, go to this url i will provide this github link in the description down below where you can get uh, the uh, project codes and wiring diagram and uh, first of all uh, go to this uh, script.js dot, uh, dot file and open spreadsheet google spreadsheet and create a new uh, spreadsheet and uh, here i'm uh, naming the spreadsheet as rfid RFI RFID attendance and in the first column uh, we have to mention date in the second column we have to mention time and in the third column card holder name that's it and after this go to uh, extension and app script and uh, clear this and go to this uh, script.js file select all the uh, content paste and he, uh, here we need to uh, uh, change this uh, spreadsheet id and here we can get the spreadsheet id and in this link uh, the highlighted part is uh, the uh, id of this sheet and simply copy this id and replace over here I have replaced the uh, ID and if you are uh, if you are out of India you if uh, doing the project from out of India then uh, you can change the time zone over here in uh, in my case I have mentioned as Asia Kolkata and uh, that's it nothing has to be changed uh, nothing has to be changed in this code and click on deploy button and new deployment and click on this uh, setting button and click on web app and select uh, the uh, email id and here uh, you we need to change this uh, uh, access to anyone and click on deploy it will take a few uh, seconds to uh, deployment for the deployment and uh, we need to authorize access and click uh, choose the email id and uh, go to this advanced and click on this go to untitled project unsafe and click on allow it will take some time and uh, we got this url and copy this 
and let's uh, test this URL. So go to new tab and paste the uh, URL and uh, put a question mark and name equal to money and click on enter. So as you can see, uh, the message is popped out like uh, a card holder name is stored in column C and uh, this is column C and as we can see the cold, uh, the uh, card holder name is stored in column C as mentioned in this URL okay and click on uh, click on done and uh, go to this uh, github again and here we need to uh, upload a, a, a code in uh, nodemcu that is card holder dot eno this one copy all the content and uh, copy and open arduino and paste uh, the uh, copied code here and uh, here nothing has to be changed uh, here we can uh, change the name according to our need in my case i have mentioned money uh, you can mention uh, anything arjun whatever you want uh, let's say it's maybe uh, let, let it be arjun only and uh, click on tools and select the port and select the board and uh, nothing has to be changed and uh, so before going to upload uh, please cross check, uh, cross -check uh, with the uh, connections I have uh, provided the uh, connection diagram in the, uh, in the uh, github link also uh, please refer while you are doing the connections and click on uh, hit on upload button and save this file so as we can see the code is uploaded successfully uh, without uh, any errors and uh, open this serial monitor I am scanning uh, this RFID tag uh, with uh, this RFID reader so as we can see as we can see the, uh, so as we can see the uh, Arjun name is stored successfully so similarly I am storing uh, another uh, name so this time I am uh, changing this Arjun into like Ram and I have to click uh, on upload again So again open the serial monitor and this time I am scanning uh, this RFID uh, uh, tag. So as we can see the block was read uh, successfully. In this uh, tag I have mentioned the name as RAM. So now this time go to uh, another code which is provided in the github link. And this time we have to go through this RFID attendance.ino file and uh, copy all the contents and open Arduino again and uh, change the whole code. So, this is the code uh, which we need to upload uh, again into our Node MCU so these are the libraries uh, which we need to install uh, include in our code and uh, here uh, we have to change our ssid and password uh, i have uh, changed the, uh, the my wi-fi uh, routers uh, ssid and password here and uh, again we need to change uh, this so we have to uh, go to this uh, url and copy this url and just we need to paste over here and as you can see after all the code will uh, look like this and uh, another main part of our project is uh, changing this footprint so let me demonstrate uh, how, do, how does it works 
and minimizing this uh, code this screen and uh, click on done and go to this RFID uh, spreadsheet and go to this uh, icon and click on uh, connection is secure and click on uh, certificate is valid so uh, we need to change uh, the uh, footprint according to the uh, browser side so as you can see i have changed already uh, like the footprint uh, code will be look like uh, 0 cross 26 and in d6 0 cross d6 and second 0 cross 3f 0 cross 3f and 7a 0 cross 7a like this uh, we have to uh, rearrange the footprint uh, like uh, we can see at the end uh, 43 0 cross 43 so we, we have to uh, change the uh, footprint in the code like uh, which is available in our website so if you are uh, facing any difficulty while changing the footprint please let me know in the comment section and uh, that's all and nothing has to be changed and so let me uh, upload this code into our node mco So uh, as we can see the code is uploaded successfully and uh, let us go to the uh, serial monitor and uh, let's uh, let me tap the RFID tag so as we can see uh, we've uh, got the success for 302 and uh, name as Arjun so let us see And as you can see, uh, we got uh, the uh, card holder name as Arjun. Again, I'm tapping another uh, RFID tag. As you can see, we got uh, the another card holder name as Ira. Arjun. So that's all about this video i hope you uh, find this video very helpful if you find this video helpful then uh, do hit that like button and also share this video among with your friends and also subscribe for more such videos and i will see you in the next one